has told Sky Sports News that he feels let down by his players and has even questioned his own future at the club. Perhaps I've been here too long. Um, but no, you know, I, I try to take uh, success and defeat the same way. I don't get too overboard and too down. But uh, this is a bit tough to take at the moment. And uh, if this would have happened to us at the start of the season, then it could have been a totally different season for us. But I do look at seasons, and it is the 38 games. And, and if we end up below halfway, that's because we're not good enough to be anywhere else. That's very unlike you, Alan, for the first time say, I'm having a think about it. Are you that down at the moment and are you thinking about your position? Well, I am a bit down about it, I must admit. Um, you know, uh, I think the players have let me down uh, on some occasions and players that uh, I expect a bit more from. But as a team, you know, I, I honestly think that uh, as a team they give their lot. And uh, But it's very difficult when you're 3-0 down against Man United at the Valley. Um, but it's up to me to turn it around and... Uh, and it's up to them to turn it around. Uh, they can feel sorry for themselves. I don't feel sorry for them. Uh, I don't feel sorry for myself. Um, this is a harsh uh, life, the football life, and uh, we take all the plaudits, and then when it goes wrong like it is at the moment, we've got to take it on the chin, and there's only one way to change it, and that's to get on with it. Could it be perhaps they've been hearing the same voice for a long time? Well, uh, maybe, but I think I've got players here that have only just come in this season, so, um, you know, I'd, I'd have to have a good think about uh, why we've tailed off again, but uh, a lot of it, I think, goes down to the team as, a, as defending because some of the goals we're letting in. I mean, Man United don't need a leg up, uh, but some of the things we we done today, uh, you know, beggars belief. But um, no, I, I've got to have a good think about it. But, uh, I've been talking to the players in there. I've got 16 fit ones, I think. I think if, if that is a setting off for Chris Perry there, then that's another one gone out. And, uh, you know, we just have to get on with it. But, you know, I've I've been here... 14 years and over the 14 years, you know, we've played against lots of teams where their managers have been under a little bit of pressure and uh, it's, it's now uh, my turn, so I've just got to get on with it. As for Manchester United, they're just one point behind Arsenal. Wayne Rooney scored his 16th goal of the season. Once we got the first goal, we knew that we could go on and control the game and um, hopefully get some more, which we did do. And um, from then, it was a f fairly comfortable game for us, and, um, which we needed. In that situation, why is the first goal so important? Um, I think because Charlton are at home and um, if they get the, get the first goal, then it gives the fans a lift as well. Then it makes it a very difficult game for us. And um, If we get the first game, the fans get on the back. And that. So, um, lucky enough, we got the first goal. It was your shot, although Paul Scholes scored. The, move, the ball seemed to move a bit in the air. Have you got any sympathy for the goalie? Um, I don't know, really. Obviously, these days, the ball just swerve everywhere, so it's hard to judge it and catch the ball properly, I think. But um, it's glad to score you followed in with the rebound. In a 4-5-1, how do you enjoy playing that kind of midfield role and getting forwards? Um, yeah, it's good. Um, I, get a lot of, I try and get into a lot of space and um, run at defenders and try and get my shots off. But um, as I say, I've played there most of the season now, so um, I'm happy there playing there. I'm not playing anywhere, really. But um, as long as you win. What about your goal? Was it another instinctive finish from you? Uh, I think it was a bad first touch, to be honest. And, um, I was stretching for it, seeing the keeper coming out. And I just um, just wanted to get get it over them, really, because I knew he was going to go down. United have struggled for goals away from home. Have you been threatening to do that to a team for a while? Yeah, I think it's been coming. Um, we've gone into games, we've had a lot of chances and haven't scored or haven't scored many. So, um, lucky enough today we got four, which is um, credit to everyone. Do you think you can catch Arsenal for second place? Um, I think so, yeah. I think obviously it's going to be difficult. They've got, um, they've got a tough game in West Brom tomorrow, fighting for relegation. So... Um, Hopefully West, West Brom can do us a favour and um, we can pick them to the end. Two goals in the week and PFA Young Player of the Year. It's been quite a week for you, hasn't it? What's it been like? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's been alright. It's been um, nice and relaxed, so um, hopefully a few more weeks like this. More now in Tottenham's thrashing of Villa. Andy Reid scored one of their five goals. His first...